Here we have the how-to on easy, quick, simple Galaxy Paint. Going to go ahead and take your board, sand it down, get your primer on there, sand that down, and we're going to start off with the black base coat. The black base coat, you're trying to just get it as black as possible. So we're going to go ahead and do one coat, and then let it dry, flash time, get your second coat on there, flash time, get your third coat on, and then we got our colors here. We've got a yellow. Our gold, pink, green, purple, okay, and blue. Since you got your black down, or whatever color you're gonna use as a base for space, you obviously want to try to use a darker color. You're gonna use a darker purple. Um, next, you're gonna grab a measuring spoon. This is a half teaspoon right here, and your pearls. Basically, just take a, a scoop. Kind of slide it anywhere you want to. You don't need a whole lot here. Now that you got that, you'll take your blow gun. Just lightly mist air over top. And you're basically trying to get rid of the, the high spots. So then you go to your next color and then go from there. If I need more air, I need to turn the compressor back on. And you can do them all at once. I just prefer to do them singly because uh, you then you get the aspects of where it actually blends together over top of each other and everything. So it gives you a completely different color there. Next color we're gonna use is a blue. Like I said, you don't need a whole lot. These are five gram bags and we're not even using five grams. Grab the blow gun again. I'm using the, I'm just using the paint gun with some inner coat into it anyways because I'm gonna need the inner coat after this. What you leave is all up to you. That's the one thing about this, it's all artist dependent. So you don't have to kind of worry about anything. It's basically what you're going for. The look you're going for is what you're gonna expect. So we've got a little bit of blue and gold. We still got our black there. Next we're going with a green, a light bright green. Obviously the black, it'll kind of tone it down.
And that's what I mean by you getting the colors blending in together. When you do it this way, is because now you have a gold underneath the blue and the green here. I'll take you above it once I, uh, once I finish all the colors and I'll let you see all that. Next up is a purple, bright purple. You don't want to cover the whole thing each way. You still want to leave some black there. So we're not we're not going heavy with the pearls. Um, you can go heavier, obviously. We're just like doing a demo. So this is going to be something that's like really light and airy. And the direction that you want to blow is all, all up to you as well. Like I said, this is a 100% organic thing, so however you want to do it, there is absolutely no right way, no wrong way. We're just showing you the one way that I've learned. Now pink, a bright pink. I don't want much there. I kind of want just like four little spots. And then for this example, that's going to be it for the color. Next to magic. So after we blow this one off, that's what I'm going to kind of do from the top. Now here comes the magic. So now we have a nice line. Some of these bigger spots here, like here, the greens. Those little, those bigger spots are gonna take a little bit more clear to go over top, but that's why we're gonna go ahead and put the uh, inner coat down first so it kind of buries some of that. Let y'all sit back up. For the next next one is our ice product this is a very big particle pearl uh 700 microns one of the biggest pearls on the market so this one you don't need a whole lot of what we're doing with this one is just trying to make stars because you throw too much too much of this down and you will see it So now we have stars in the galaxy. I'll blow that off. Spray a couple coats of inner coat down to try to kind of lock that down in place, and then we'll go clear. Coat to inner coat, clear, and then we'll come back. That's your inner coat. This is what we have. Next up, we'll clear it. And then once we clear it, all that orange peel will be gone. 
because we're gonna spit a sand and a little bit of pinstriping on top. All those pearls are there. And they all blend together, but you can still see shots of them. And that candy shop ice, the ice pearl, those are all the little dots of stars in the galaxy. Now, if you go bigger, you want to go um, bigger with the dots, like kind of dump a little bit more on. You can dump more on, and then instead of having small pigment spots, you'll have bigger ones, and it'll blow dust out a little bit further. But this is not what I was going for with this one. This was kind of more of a, a smaller type. So that, that way, when you look at it, and you can do it with any pearls. You can do it with our hallucination pearls, any of the color pearls or any of the powder pearls from anywhere else, it'll all work exactly, exactly the same, but it has to be a powder. It cannot be a liquid. So now we're gonna go ahead and uh, get some clear on this. And then after clear, I'll get you another picture and then we're all set. All right, here we go back in 4K and here's after clear. As you can see, it flattened out real well. You have the tones of the gold, the green, the blue, all underneath each other. And you got the, the white ice particle stars. And then once this dries, you can go ahead and sand it back down and either pinstripe or come back and do some uh, airbrush designs to try to get yourself uh, a couple planets in there, add a sun, you know, do it or do whatever you want to. But that's what you got. It's very quick, very easy, and doesn't take a lot of material either. If you'd like to see more of these, like, subscribe, and share these.